welcome back to my channel and welcome to the first episode of Workshop Wars. Yes, I am standing in my workshop and I think this would be a perfect place to start because although it is a whip, I think I've decided in my head that I will guys, I will, I will guys, this is starting off great. <laughs> I will keep you guys abreast of what's going on in my workshop while we go through all the other workshops. Um, I don't know. I just think this would be kind of a cool idea. I don't know. It, it sounded good in my head. But anyways, um, we're going to go ahead and feature some workshops that I have uh, listed on the forums. At least people have suggested to me on the forums as well as my guildmates. And of course, we will feature some of the more well-known workshops um, because I just feel like they need to be uh, given some some love too. Why? Because, well, there are other people that watch this video or these videos that don't play Boundless. And I am trying to get, give, get Boundless some more attention. I know that I'm a peon, but hey, you never know, you never know. So we just want to show off the game. That's my my main goal here is to show off this game. All right. So don't disappoint me, guys. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. OK, um, I really should be saying I shouldn't be. I should be worried about disappointing <laughs> everyone else because. Oh, well, yeah, you'll see. You'll see. OK, so this is what's going on in my workshop right now. I know the lighting is terrible. Forgive me. It's, it's a work in progress. I've got a lot to do yet, but this is Pixel Tech. I'm kind of going for the cyberpunk look, um, even though cyberpunk is, uh, it, it broke my heart that the game is, well, I don't know what, what the state of the game is right now, but it was unplayable before, um, not necessarily for PC Master Race, <clears throat> but for a lot of console, you guys know, you know the story. So I was kind of hoping that I would get to play the game. I have not played the game. It just really did not interest me as much as like their other games like Witcher. But, um, you know, CD, CDPR, CD, PDR, C, whatever, you know your names. I still believe in you. I do. All right. So um, <clears throat> I digress. I digress. So this is what's going on here so far. Um, I have some ideas. I know right now this doesn't make any sense compared to like this right here in the middle. Um, but I will tie it in, I promise you, I promise you, some way, somehow, um, my mind just works strangely. Once I get to building things, I start getting ideas and I go off on some little tangent and that's where we're at. Um, so this is the beginning of uh, the Cyber City. Um, so yeah, I am still working on it. There's still a lot to be done. So please don't judge me right now. Please don't judge me. Um, but I will make sure that I uh, finish this up and give you guys updates as I go. But this is all that I have done so far. This is still needs to be worked on. Obviously, this isn't done. That isn't done. Um, this isn't done. Nothing's done. Nothing's done. This is this is done. This this is it. That is done. Um, this is still not done. This is done. <laughs> so is anything done down here? This is done so far i may actually add to it probably will but so far this is the middle part right here son um so yeah what's with the gears down here and this is all supposed to be cybernetics well my idea the story behind this was these gears once powered this workshop but they're now defunct and they have no use but you know we didn't want to um let go of the past and so they are now encased in this glass as reminders of where my little city came from. That's the story, Morning Glory. So let's go uh, check out some of these other workshops. So the first workshop that I had um, on my list was on Fanata. So I'm kind of hoping that I'll be able to find it because sadly, Brown Town is no longer in... Uh, in existence, so I was told that it is on Fanata. So give me a minute to get my bearings because I always forget like where stuff is. And um, let me see, where is Fanata? There we go, T2. I did bring my good grapples um, for this because I figured I'd need them. Okay, so, uh, all right. So I have the coordinates, the coordinates. Uh, for this particular workshop. This is by Dax. And what I'm going to do is try to find the, the workshop and then I will come back 
and we'll be there. Okay, so I'll be right back. Welcome back. I'm on my way to, uh, I believe it's Dax's on uh, workshop. I'm still hoping that it's there. Gosh, I hope this is no one like coming to check to see what I'm doing. It's always somebody, always somebody, but it looks like they're going through a portal. Okay, let's not make it awkward. Okay, let's not. Let's just pretend we're not here. You don't see me. You don't see me. Um, so I don't know whose guild or whose um, <laughs> whose workshop this is. I'm gonna see. Who is it? Uh, Hera Leon. Not sure if I'm saying that name right, but um, yeah, this was a cool looking workshop. I rolled up on it on my way to Daxis, and I these little towers um, piqued my interest, so um, I decided to check it out. Check, check, check it out. I don't know why I'm singing. Wow, Brown Town, your town is the hardest to get around. <laughs> Bars, but for real, um, I thought this was really cool. It has a little shop to it, looks like. Uh, okay, maybe not. This is where they're storing their, their atlases. But yeah, this is a workshop. There's um, crafting tables and, uh, okay, there's a hole. Um, and there were some machines in here, some storage. Kind of a cool little place yeah lots of lots of um workbenches and so on and so forth i really like how this is built i love like all the the little extra little coves in here uh, what are these these are extractors so yeah nicely done nicely done looks like um there's still some work that needs to be done here but uh, i figured i'd stop in on my way to um to Dax's place. I'm hoping Dax's place is still here. But let's look get a better look see at their workshop slash storage. Very nice. Um I'm assuming that they're still going to put something underneath, I'm not sure. Um but yeah that is crazy large. Very big. Um lots of room to lots of room for activities. Okay, I'm gonna keep going and I will be right back. So I ran all the way over here thinking that the portal to Dax's place was shut the way it's shut, okay? Um, I guess I'm going to be quoting movies and singing songs all day to you guys. Hope you don't mind. <laughs> I'm in that kind of mood. So there's all kind of portals here. Look at this place. Oh, wow. <laughs> Denied once again, but look at this place. You guys, this is crazy. So I was told that I would be highly impressed by Dax's workshop. Let me tell you something. This is just the outside. So I cannot wait to see what's on the inside. So there's portals here and one to the throne. Oh, oh, these are slowly shutting down on me. Zero seconds. How many seconds? Zero seconds. <laughs> What is going on? <laughs> Dax. Okay, well, I guess we're walking, guys. <laughs> we are walking. <laughs> All right, that's fine. That's fine. That's why we brought the good grapples, because I had a feeling that we would be uh, grappling. I had a feeling I would be grappling. <laughs> oh, oh, nice. Look at these thrones. Oh my goodness. These are really cool. I love the different colors. Do they all represent like different people? This is cool. This is some good lighting. Like Lancelot's, he would appreciate the rainbow colors. He loves rainbow lighting. And I think this would be completely up his alley. This is really good. Look at the chiseling and wow, look at that. Look at the details. I'm, I'm gonna have to say this is impressive. I don't see a workshop yet, but I was told there was a workshop here. Um, so, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I'm reserving. I'm reserving my judgment. <laughs> Considering that I walked all the way out here, um, there better be a workshop here. I'm judging. I'm kidding, I'm kidding. If it's not a workshop, it's fine, it's fine. This looks like the beginnings of a workshop. Like maybe there's something hidden. What's going on? This is cool. Wow, look at that. Ooh, I love this. Wow, okay. 
what what is with the the numbers this is really pretty even if I don't see a workshop I would not be disappointed this is so good I know there's a workshop here because there's a portal but this is really good this is this is really good I'm hoping I'll find a uh, let's let's scrapple down can we no can't do that is it up here are we it just keeps on going that is such a look at that that's really pretty that is gorgeous at night I hope I get a screenshot of that uh, before I leave yeah this keeps going up so I don't want to keep going up I want to be able to find the portal or at least the door to your workshop so let us head oh is this what is this this is underneath no we were just from here we were just in here i think maybe maybe not okay uh, let's head over here and see if this is the workshop i don't know i'm not sure so Maybe it's out. Maybe it's way up there. I don't know. Maybe it's up there. I probably didn't climb up far enough, and um, I may have to, to swing up there and look because this is not all right. So it this might be the workshop over here. Maybe that's why there was a portal because um, it said like portal two, tower one, tower two, and then color and then workshop. This looks like color. Is that can't be right. Um I don't know. Let's let's see. Let's let's grapple and check it out. Oh gosh. Um Yeah, this just keep going up. What what is you guys I guess we're walking. We're gonna walk all the way up and see what's up here. Um uh, this might be just like Oh, so this is like their storage for colors, right? This is what it looks like. We've got storage boxes and colors, and I'm assuming these are the color numbers. Um, I'm assuming, I don't know, but that's what it looks like. That's what I gather. Yeah, there's no workshop up here. Hmm, where else could I look? Where else could it be? Um, we will check over here again, and if not, no biggie. That looked like that might be workshop over there. But, um, yeah. I was told this was a workshop. <laughs> That's what I was told. Um, so don't blame me, guys. Do not blame me. Do not go in the comments and say, well, the first one wasn't a workshop. Not my fault. Not my fault. This was the information that I was given, and I went with it. And I trust you guys to give me correct information. I'm kidding. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Uh, oh, wait. Maybe it's down here. No, because this is where I just... Well, it's probably closed off is what it is. That's probably what it is. Um, yeah, because this is ice down here. And... Uh, let's see. I think it was. Yeah. We'll go check over here real quick and see what this is about. Oh, oh, whoa, shut the front door. Oh my, listen, I want to apologize right now for all the stuff that I was talking like two minutes ago. Look at this place. You have got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. Oh my gosh. Look at the forge. Okay, I don't wanna like fall down. This is insane oh my gosh is this like glass okay i just want to make sure that i don't lose my life in here oh my gosh <gasps> okay so you can go down this way what oh wow 
This is breathtaking. This is breathtaking. Listen. What is this? This is crazy. You have got to be kidding me right now. Look at how the furnaces are set up. Y'all, do you see what I'm, I know you see what I see because I'm seeing what I see. Oh my gosh. Look at the lighting in this place. Look at the lighting in this place. Look at the shape of the, the workshop. This is insane. It's, I love the geometric shapes. I love the lighting. It is freaking crazy. All the chis, look at all the chiseling they had to do for all the like the little pieces of gleam. That is insane. Look at this. And they have the nerves to tell me that it's a whip. Okay, well, okay, I can see where it's a whip. But where are you, Dax? And why haven't you finished this? This is crazy. Get your butt back in this game and finish this workshop. I need to see this done. Like now. Not now, but now. Okay? This is insane. I am so impressed right now. What a way to start off Workshop Wars. Um, truly. What is what's down here? I'm scared. I'm not going in there. Truly. I am, this is probably the, the, this is the most unique workshop I've ever seen in this game. And I have seen some workshops. I want to make sure I get that, <laughs> that off my, that location off my uh, list. Oh gosh, this is crazy. Enjoy it. Enjoy it, guys. Take it all in. Come see this. This is on Fanata. You'll have to run here. It's called the Daxington Estates. Um, and the coordinates are 1598 North, negative uh, 201 East. Come out here, see this, enjoy this, love this. I am in awe. I'm definitely gonna have to take a screenshot of this. Um, and um, I don't know, crazy, insane. Love you, Dax. <laughs> I am in love with you. I don't, I don't know who you are. I'm in love with your creativity. This is crazy. Wow, okay. So, great way to start off Workshop Wars. Hopefully, I will be able to find the rest of you guys, and I'll be just as impressed as I am by this. Yikes. Okay, I will be back. Welcome back. I am in the Garden Pavilion. I guess this is B Knight. Is that the name of this person? Knight Manager. So, I just happened to be looking for someone else's workshop, and I saw this portal. Uh, this is on Roxa, and um, this is actually really cool. So if you can just let me let me get my grapples out because I sense death. Um, <laughs> but this is look at it's all tiered out. It looks like a treehouse, and they've even got. I think I've been out here before. Yes, I have. Okay, so there's the portal area, or a portal area, and I came out here for rocks. And um, I did see this before. So let me just slide on down. Oh, this is fun. This is why I love slide. It's awesome. So they've got their um, workshop kind of tiered up here. And I think you can, yeah, you can walk up back this way. I love the quick way down. I love it. Okay. Um, but I just thought this was really cool because I, I love the treehouse look. Um, and it goes over there. Oh, what a good shot. Um, Oh, I, I, yeah, I like this. It's very organic. Um, I do like a good organic looking build. I think that's why Pier Cosas is probably one of my um, favorite workshops because uh, it just looks so natural, like it just belongs where it's at. So this is a good shot. This is or a good little um, view. Like it goes all the way up. And okay, this was another part of the hub. So this is like um, their workshop slash shops. Um, looks like there might be some shops over there, two shop stands over there. But this is ex this is where their it looks like their main shop is. But I thought this was cute. Um, oh gosh, I just clenched up a little bit. But uh, you can see like they have this walkway 
going across here. Um, I, it's really cute, and all the kindling shred that um, people use is such a, so expensive. My heart just breaks because <laughs> kindling, <laughs> like all that kindling, just just sitting there. Okay, so yep, thought I'd um, detour over here, and then I'm gonna hop back over to the portal area, and let's see, let's just run over here really quick. Oh gosh, get out of here. Um, let me see, yep. Grab a hold, uh, jump up, jump up. Great, I don't have any pies with me and I'm running out of energy, that's lovely. I'm gonna have to stop and get some pies on my way to the next, um, what is this, this is their forge? Oh, okay. Yeah, the see, this is cool. This is really cool. You guys have some of the most unique ideas for workshops. Mine is so blah compared to everyone else's, but it gives me um, a lot of ideas and it gives other people's ideas um, that might have the same taste in workshops or at least the same taste in maybe decor or theme or like whatever. You know what I'm saying? So I think this is really cool. Um, nicely done. Uh, was it Night Manager? Let me make sure I... Knight Smith. Okay, so we have different names. B Knight is your name, right? And then you've got like Knight Manager, Knight Smith. So basically, Manager must be the store area. This is Smith, so this is Foraging. Gotcha. Okay, so it must be like your different tunes. I gotcha. I understand. I'm picking up what you're putting down. All right, so quick stop, another quick stop on the way to my next destination. Hopefully, I'll be able to find it. Hopefully, it's still there. So I will talk to you guys soon. Welcome back to Serenity. This is uh, Serenity Lodge, east of Labyrinth's Fabric. And, whoa. Oh my gosh. Wait a minute, is this their... What? Is this their workshop? Hold on, wait a minute. Hold up, wait a minute. Wow, okay, 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 okay. So this is like their lodge here. It looks like this is where they um, possibly just keep things. But first of all, this, this area right here is gorgeous. It gives me a druidic feel, right? For all my druids, my wow druids, wow players, play druids. <laughs> Look at this. This looks like to me like a night elf would live here. Right, a night elf druid, um, and this would be uh, the tree that Sylvanas burned down. Am I am I speaking to wild WoW players out there? Look at this. Okay, we've got to figure out how to get up here. Is this is there a portal? This is to here it is. Man, okay. So yes, this is their workshop. Oh my gosh. How do we how do we get up? Okay, there was actual there was an actual stairway. This is amazing. What is this? Okay, so this is another part of the workshop. Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, let's let's head back up here. This looks so good. How are you? See. I would have a hard time navigating. Oh, look at how adorable the little cups of coffee in the book. Oh, this is so me sitting here looking at the view. It's so pretty. Look at how gorgeous this is. This is very serene. I am loving it. Hence the name Serenity. Yes. Okay. So this is where all your machines are. I love this. Coiled up, crystal minter. <laughs> I had to stop and wait and figure out how to say that. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so stupid. I can't stand me. Ooh. Okay, so they've got storage up here too. This is really well done. This is a very nicely done workshop. My hands are are clapping now for you in my mind. These. This is really cool. This is really cool. Gorgeous, 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 gorgeous workshop. Love it. 
Once again, I'm impressed. This is a great start to Workshop Wars. You guys are so creative. And this is why I love this game because you guys have some of the most creative minds and um, I am celebrating it with you. Seriously, not even jealous. I wanna celebrate this all with you. This is great. So where's this at? This is, uh, if you go through, is this the TNT? Okay, this is Chromas. Welcome to Chromas. Okay, so you can find this through Rocks, the Rocks of Portal, TNT, and then you would want to go through the Serenity Portal in that portal room, and you'll find it here. So hopefully that's good directions. Um, and yeah, this is this is definitely something you want to see up close and personal. Like, look at that trunk. Look at it. That is really cool. That is really cool. I'm going to tell you right now, if I attempted this, it would not look like that at all. So I'm... I'm impressed, definitely impressed. Thank you for letting me see your workshop. All right, so let's go to the next one. Okay, I happened to stumble onto this workshop and this is the Crystal Habitat and I guess this is by Cogs. Uh, Splutty is the name of this player. And I thought this was kind of cool. I think this is like not too far from where we, where we were. Um, it's hard to tell, but we are definitely up high and I can't really get the shape of this place. Um, but yeah, we are we are pretty far up. And yeah, cause that, that's the tree up there it looks like, maybe, I don't know. Yeah, there it is, that's the tree. So I remember seeing this off in the distance. Um, so, ooh. Okay, so you can get an idea what this looks like from the reflection on there. Um, so it's kind of like a planetary looking build, but um, this is their workshop. So we're gonna try to head down without like dying. Whoops. Um, I really need to get some pies. I had some on me, but I ate them all. I'm greedy. Um, yeah, pretty simple, like as far as like the setup, but the build is not, because we all know building um, spheres are annoying. But this looks really good. I'm gonna see if I can get a better view of this. Oh gosh, I hate swimming in this game. Good. Okay. Okay, that is the other floor. How far does this go down? Okay, that's it, that's it. I came in through a portal somewhere. I want to say it was here, surface blocks, didn't I? Could have sworn I came through a portal. Is it down here? Yeah, here it is. Okay, so this is where I came. So I don't know, is this like the guild? Uh, I don't know. I can't find my way out of this, but this is where I came, and I actually came through the Roxa portal, um, and it's right here, actually right next to Serenity. So if you see Serenity, you'll be able to go through the Crystal Habitat. Check this out. Um, I'm going to just kind of look around and see if there's any other workshops here before I head out. Uh, doesn't look like it. At least nothing that's clearly labeled workshop. Let's see what this Stagni Falls is. Maybe this is something I might look at for hidden gems. Hmm. Not necessarily workshop, but okay. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and head back, see if I can find another workshop, and I think that will wrap it up today. We'll just do one more, one more workshop. And I think we might end up um, ending the the video with a an oldie but goodie. All right, see you guys in a minute. You guys probably figured I'd end up here, or maybe you didn't, maybe you thought I was gonna fangirl it out and head to HSC. I mean, yes, there, workshop is glorious hands down by all means um give them some credit that that is one of the most outstanding workshops guild workshops but as far as like singular like this is my workshop personal solo dolo no one else um, as far as that, this is the best workshop that I've seen so far in the game, simply because of just how it was planned out. Um, 
how the use of different machines to make them look like something completely different, um, how creative here is. And so I just love his whole aesthetic. And this is my favorite workshop, solo, single workshop in the game so far. Now, of course, there may be other workshops that outshine. Um, I certainly love Dax's. Um, so Dax's is definitely right up there. Oh, this is dangerous. I hope that's locked. Is this locked? No, okay, <laughs> let's make sure. Um, but yeah, this workshop is so creative. And I just am, uh, am in awe at how his mind works. Um, he and Gregorio, I say Gregorio, his name is Giorgio, but I always call him Gregorio for some reason. I don't know why, um, but he knows his name, <laughs> George George. But listen, this is awesome. Okay, also George George's his, his workshop. Okay, so maybe there's a tie. Maybe there's a tie, really. As, if we were doing like a whole like, oh, this workshop one over the other, which I could never do because everyone has their own um, style and everyone does well with the style that they own. And this, if, as far as like style is concerned, um, this is like my favorite because it's it just, I don't know, it speaks to me. It does, it speaks to me. If anything, if something inanimate could speak to me, this would be a thing um, as far as like in this game. This is so cool. It's just well done. There's so much to see. All the little doors, nooks and crannies, um, just places to get lost. I love how he did this little mini storage area and it displays um, all the items in the game. Uh, it just, it looks really cool and it leads into other rooms. And every time I come here, I see something different. I didn't even see this. Does this open up? I had no idea this was up here. So yeah, every time I come in here, I see something new. And um, I have to say that about the Reapers area as well. Um, but these are just so well done. Look at this. Uh, I get a lot of my build ideas just from uh, walking around and looking at his his workshop, um, but look at the amount of detailing he has in this workshop. Just come and see it. And it's very easy to find if you, um, I found it through Ultima and then his like his portal, um, the main portal from TNT, the Ultima portal. And then as soon as you walked out, I made like a left and I went around the back of the these, uh, planet portals and his is like, down a little bit you can see it. it's one of the smaller ones but there you have it guys this is how we end right here at the afk hope you enjoyed this first uh, episode of workshop wars if there's other workshops that you want me to see let me know tell me in the comments tell me in the forums i really would love to know all right guys until next time i've been pixelated twix ciao